Hey, hey, hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be taking a look at um, Rainbow High Series 3 Daphne Minton. So my husband bought me this doll as a gift. I keep telling him not, not to do that because I have so many dolls in box right now that I need to film videos for. But he's just super nice, so he does little things like that for me. So, yeah, I just wanted to open her up because the Series 3 girls are seriously so pretty. So, let's just get right into it. We have Daphne Minton here in the box. Her color is mint. <laughs> um, up here, collect the rainbow. As usual, we have up here, it says Series 3 Daphne Minton. We have the YouTube sticker. Her second outfit, she's packaged just like all the other series before her, um, as in like one and two, because the winter break have a little bit of a different style box. Um, and then we have artwork of the series three girls. Here we have all of the girls. They're so gorgeous. So that one is Gabriella Emmy. Is her? I believe her name is Rosalyn. And then we have Georgia, Cheryl, and of course, Daphne. So one thing I really like about the Series 3 boxes is that over here on the side, we actually get a logo of their little um, focus. So she is accessory design focus. She loves the different gems and stuff like that. We have the artwork on the back of the box. Who is your favorite girl? Let me know in the comments down below. I really like the look of Gabriella, but she's just so kind of like super mean. And that's what made me buy Violet last because I was just like, eh, her personality, eh. Um, I have Cheryl. I don't know who I want to get next. So let me know who your favorite is down below. Up here has the Rainbow High logo. Let's see. Right here it says, Welcome to Rainbow High, the colorful art school full of bold fashions and even bolder drama. Now, isn't that just so true? The series has gotten so dramatic, um, but I love it. And if you wanted to take a closer look at her logo. All right, I'm gonna just get her right on out of the box and we'll get right into the review. Okay, Miss Daphne Minton is out of the box and she is, I think her like screening makes her look super sweet and I love that. Um, her screening is a little bit different, so let's just take a look at that. Actually, let me tell you what she comes with first. We have her second outfit here. Now, if you have been collecting Rainbow High since the beginning, you would probably know the back of these boxes are always like glued to high heaven and stuck on the freaking back of the box. And then you have to try and rip this off and then like the whole packaging rips. Hers was not like that whatsoever. So, um, because I really like these boxes and I think they make cute displays, but when they're glued like that, you just end up ripping the whole box. Um, so if that is something you are like into, is like the, the like side boxes series, I don't know if it's all series three or just my Daphne. Um, the box was fine to pull out, like it came out so easy, and I like that. Um, we have a mint stand which i love um it's nice to see like different shades of colors coming from rainbow high and of course we have her matching comb and the luxurious hangers that say rainbow and the pants hanger all right now on to the queen herself miss daphne so let's take a look at her screening uh, my favorite thing is that she has freckles uh, the other day when I was looking at, I think it was a slumber party doll or something. Um, I was like, wow, I just wish Rainbow High would put freckles on the dolls. And my husband was like, um, Daphne has freckles. I was like, no, she doesn't. You don't know what you're talking about, sir. Um, no, he was right. She has freckles. I'm like, how cute. Oh, I love it. Um, and then her screening, I don't know if you can tell. Her eyes, I think, are a different shape. They're kind of like more slanted down, I think. Or less round they're kind of like a nice almondy shape i really like that it's a nice different little um characteristic for this doll she has some um i'm gonna call that brown and blue with a gold crease eyeshadow it is sparkly 
course, real eyelashes, inset eyes. I love the inset eyes. Now for her um, outfit, it is like super luxurious. Like I know all of the Rainbow High girls are supposed to have like designer fashion. Like it kind of like mocks designer trends that are out or whatever. But hers, I think of all the Rainbow High dolls I've unboxed, it seems like the most luxurious to me. Um, first off, let's talk about her gigantic hoop earrings. So um, they are gold chain and they say rainbow. Uh, we have not had a doll with earrings this big, and I love that. Um, we have her jacket here. I know this is mimicked after some high-end brand. I'm not a high-end, like, enthusiast of any sort, so I couldn't tell you what, but I just know it is. She has um, a white crop top. It's just like a tank top with the same print on the band here. Um, and if the jacket were to zip, it would have an RH in the center, just like it does here on the arm. And there's just like gold chain detailing. Um, and it's like a silk jacket material. We have our faux zipper here. That's a little RH. Her skirt, I forget the, um, what this, uh, fabric is called, but it's kind of, um, not like knit, but kind of of, of that genre of material. Um, and it is just like the teal or the mint color. And then we have a little gold metal um, hoop here. And we have this little, uh, it looks like scarf material just tied into it, which is a really cute detail. And then as for her shoes, they are just like a light blue or they're coming off light blue on camera. They're more of a teal color, of course, um, or mint color. And they're just strappy pumps, not pumps, just some strappy heels. They have a clear band across the toes. And we have our little gold RH logo, of course. My shoes are a little chipped, but that's okay. I'm not like super, I gotta get replacement shoes. But um, now let's talk about her hair because we have a little bit of an issue. It's nothing I can't fix. Her ends are kind of um, frazzled, frizzled. I don't know what you would call that but a boil wash will smooth that out. Um, she is pretty thickly rooted, but the way her hair was packaged in the box is like split. And so you can see her scalp. A boil wash and a nice shampoo will fix that right up for her. I've heard some people talking about how the Series 3 dolls aren't as thickly rooted. Um, yeah, it's a little sparse back here, but also with a wash, a good cleanup, the girl, you're never gonna be able to see it. So for me, it doesn't bug me. If that's something that bugs you, I would definitely check out your dolls then. Um, and then her lips, I really like her lips. I'm really thankful for my husband because he knows like, I look at doll screenings. So when he surprises me with a doll, he's like, oh yeah, I looked at them all. This one had the best makeup, the best face paint. So um, this one has really nice face paint. Um, the lips look so like lifelike. And I think that's super cute. Her, she just looks so sweet. I think she, she's probably gonna be like a super sweet character. <laughs> if I'm wrong, I'll feel sad. Um, I'm going to pull these out of the box, put her in her second outfit, and then we'll take a look at that on her. Okay, so we have Daphne in her second outfit, and I wanted to point out some things I forgot to mention. I always forget this whenever I'm sharing a Rainbow High doll. Miss Girl has her nails painted, and they are just a little mint color. And also, we have the articulated head so let's take a look at her outfit because her outfit is super cute of course um let's first start with her top it is a white crop t-shirt we have some gold and black chain detail up here and it says rainbow high it looks like it would be like little charms with the letters um we have this jacket which is like super plush it kind of feels like a soft towel material which sounds kind of weird but that's what it feels like to me um, and of course we have some gold um, seams here we have gold trim on the pocket and around the sleeves um, 
and then her pants are super cute they're like a high-waisted denim jean but they have like some patchwork so we have a different color of mint up here we have like this um gold kind of paisley print here we have this um looks like a snakeskin patch it says rainbow high and white cursive here but we have a patch covering part of the high part um and that's like a cheetah but print or something um we have our little button and then the back i'll just take her off the stand the back she has her pockets her big badonk donk her pants won't close all the way and then we have that same different type material the same different that makes a lot of sense alex so it's like the same color as up here but it's on the back um and then we have that color down here and then her shoes are so cute so they're meant to have like little zippers right here and it looks like it's unzipped right here for the strap and they're just a little strappy heel but i think the zipper detailing is super cute also i really love her eyebrows my eyebrows will never never in my lifetime look that good all right you guys so that is going to wrap up this video i hope you all enjoyed leave me a comment down below who is your favorite series three girl and why do you like their personalities from the tv series because i love that we're getting so much of that um or do you have like a specific color and that's why it's your favorite um yeah just let me know in the comments down below be sure to like and subscribe for more videos just like this i will be posting every monday wednesday and friday and probably most saturdays um but yeah i hope you guys all have a wonderful week and i will see you guys in my next video bye everyone